Hi friends, this is Selvajan here. Welcome to my networking channel. Hope all are doing good and safe. And this is an architecture where connected only two routers, R1 and R2. So both R1 and R2 both are in the different autonomous systems, right? Both as established an EBGV neighbor relationship with each other. So now let us understand what is a hard and the soft reset. So hard reset will break the entire BGP neighbor relationship, right? It will kill the entire TCP session and it will again reset all the neighbor relationship. But soft reset, it will not kill the TCP session or kill the BGP neighbor but instead it, instead it will request for a fresh update from the neighbor so that is the difference I am going to show before that let us quickly configure the BGP neighbor relationship between R1 and R2 so now let us go to the R1 configuration mode and let us quickly configure the neighbor right so router BGP1 and the neighbor is 192.168.12.2 right so there are only single neighbor 12.2 and the remote AS is autonomous number is 2 since it is an EBGB neighbor and similarly will advertise the prefix that is 1.1.1 1 .1 1. so configuration mode network is 1.1.1 1 .1 1 .1 and mask is 255.255.255.255 so I will advertise the prefix I already advertised the prefix let us go to R2 and configure the neighbor right so go to configuration mode router BGP2 so this is an autonomous number system number 2 and the neighbor command is 192.168.12.1 and the remote autonomous system number is 1 right so now it will establish the neighbor relation we show ip bgp all summary yeah so it will take some time show ip bgp all summary Yeah, so now you are able to see the neighbor, right? So neighbor is a show IP BGB all summary. You are able to see the neighbor relationship. Similarly, R2 has established an EBGB neighbor relationship with each other, right? So this is already done. So what I can I have already advertised the prefix also. So you can see the prefix R2 show IP BGP. Show IP BGP. Show IP BGP. So sometimes BGP table will take some time to reflect. So yeah, this is a routing table. So we are able to see network 1.1.1 and the next of attribute is 00 because it's coming from the origin, right? Same route. And let us see from R1, sorry, R2, show IP BGP. Yeah. So we are able to see network is 1.1.1 and the next of attribute is 12.1. This is the next of interface 12.1. So now what I'm going to do, I'm going to configure the local preference and let us do a hard reset. I will show how to do a hard reset. So go to configuration mode and do router BGP2, right? And neighbor statement. So neighbor, let us set the root map attribute. Root map. So root map and the local preference, I said it's some attribute value, local preference in this inbound traffic, right? So after that, I have to configure the root map statement. So root map LOC, that is a value, local preference value and permit statement followed by the sequence number. Now let us set the local preference attribute as some 500. So you can't see it immediately. So now what you have to do, I have to do a hard reset, right? So I'm going to show what is a hard reset. So what you have to do, clear IP BGP star and similarly here also, clear IP BGP star. So what is the function of this clear IP BGP? What happened? It will kill the entire TCP session. So for establishing the neighbor, always it forms a TCP three-way handshake with each other. It will establish the neighbor relationship, then we will start or sharing the update. So update is nothing but it will advertise the prefix and the path attributes like local preference or MED. So that is the difference between neighbor and the network statement, right? So now clear IP BGB, what happened? It will kill the entire TCP session and it is going to again, again establish a new TCP session. So after uh, applying this command, you can see the neighbor will go down. Clear IP BGP. So here also I'm doing clear IP BGP. So what happened immediately you are seeing, right? The neighbor is going down and it will try to establish a new neighbor relationship with R2. Similar way R2 is also 
you will try to do a reset of neighbor it will to total the neighbor reset and it will try to establish a new neighbor with r1 right so that is the purpose of hard reset and also it will take some for time to reflect in the routing table yeah so you have to see the now the prefix show ip bgp see now you are able to see the changed value of 500 right so hard reset is nothing but it is killing the bgp session or it is going to kill the entire tcp session and it will going to establish a tcp 3 way handshake with the neighbor so that is the purpose of hard reset but what soft reset does is it will not kill the bgp session right so the neighbor will not go down it will not reset the neighbor instead it will request for the fresh update from the neighbor right so it will request for a fresh bgp table from the neighbor so that is the purpose of soft reset so what we can do let us but hard reset is taking a lot of time right so so hard soft reset will not take much time so let us go to the configuration mode go to neighbor router bgp2 right so router bgp2 and configure neighbor root map local so let us change the value and do the soft reset root map local preference loc admit 10 let us set the local preference value as 900 so ip bgp so it is not showing right 900 so let us do a soft reset clear ip bgp so this is a command clear ip bgp 12.1 so 192.168.12.1 soft in so immediately what happened you can immediately see the update so you are able to see right it will take within only within a fraction of seconds we are able to see the update but in case of hard reset it will kill the tcp session three way handshake and it will try to establish the neighbor again then it will request for fresh update from the neighbor right so that is the purpose of hard reset it will take a lot of time but in case of soft reset it will just request for a fresh update from the neighbor so immediately it pushes the update and it will show up in the bgp routing table so we are able to see the changed value right i have changed the local preference as 900 and it is immediately reflecting in the bgp table so that is the difference between hard and the soft reset i hope you understood the difference between hard and soft reset thanks for watching please subscribe me for more videos thank you have a wonderful day